This year's distinguished alumnus is Dr. William Fabian, class of 1984. Uh, William A. Fabian Jr. is a world-renowned physician, medical researcher, professor in the field of gastroenterology. Uh, <laughs> Dr. Dr. Fabian is director of the Pediatric Inflammatory Bowel Disease Center at the Mayo Clinic, Rochester, and has a joint appointment in the Department of Internal Medicine, Pediatrics, and Immunology at Mayo Medical School. Dr. Fabian has lectured wild, widely at the national and international level and authored more than 100 papers and articles in peer-reviewed journals and textbooks. Dr. Fabian entered Kincaid in the third grade and graduated in 1984. He was a three-sport athlete all four years of college, participating in football, soccer, and golf. He also served as class president during his freshman, sophomore, and senior years. Dr. Fabian and his wife Stephanie reside in Rochester, Minnesota, and he is the proud father of five daughters. His sister, Annette Fabian Stevens, is a Kincaid graduate from the class of 1982. His nephew, Sam Stevens, is a member of the class of 2014. His niece, Annie Stevens, was in the class of 2012. And niece, Louise Stevens, is in the class of 2016. Now, please enjoy this short video on Dr. Fabian's life at Kincaid and his outstanding professional career. I remember him smiling a lot. He was really nice. He was easy to have in the classroom. Very friendly. Did you, did you have any classes with Bill? I don't think Bill and I ever had classes together. Uh, I know he was a great student, an accomplished student. He was kind of a secret studier, it seemed to me like, because uh, he was always around when we were having fun, doing other things. Uh, but he was a great student and a great friend. He was a hard-nosed, tenacious football player. Uh, he was a, a team player. And I can remember working out with the offensive backs and everything, Coach Way yelling, don't get beat deep. I mean, this throughout the entire practice, don't get beat deep. And uh, in most cases, Bill didn't get beat deep and was a real asset to our program. I am close to Bill. Uh, you know, he's my only brother. And I had a very close family, a lot of laughs. Um, we had moved around quite a bit growing up, so for many years, which is the four of us moving. Once he got away from us, that's when he really took off. It took him getting out of Kincaid to sort of fly. Yeah, I always knew Bill would uh, be an accomplished, have lead an accomplished life, uh, that I'd ever be sitting here uh, telling about him, you know, becoming a distinguished alumni. Not sure I ever saw that, but. Uh, you know, it's a tremendous accomplishment and not at all surprising that he's gone on to you know, the great heights that he's gone on to. Unfortunately, I wish he lived, wish he lived a lot closer. Um, but we managed to keep in touch with texts and sending pictures of the kids. We see him every year, uh, both Matt and I and other friends in an annual high school, I mean an annual golf event that we do. Uh, it's a lot of fun and use the same you know, reunions and holidays as well. Yeah, so he comes in from Minnesota, but like last year he couldn't make it because he was in India giving some some speech or solving some uh, disease or something. So we were happy that he you know, was doing that. I think Bill is a tremendous choice. I mean, not only has he obviously um, just in his career, he's, he's flourished, uh, and I'm sure others will, will speak to that, but um, he has... He's always excelled, really, in, in every area of his life. Yeah, he, he's, he's told me a hundred times what he does, and I, I still have no idea what it is, but I know it's great. So, not a surprise. He's, he's a smart, great guy, good guy. Bill has become an internationally renowned leader in the biomedical field. His work is not only impacting the life of many individuals in the USA, but also those living in other parts of the world, including Africa. Would I have predicted his success? And I'm not totally sure because I don't think that physics was his big um, thing then. That he, he did really well in physics. But um, I would have liked to see him in biology or bio 2. That would have been interesting. 
Well, he didn't always study. Um, I remember the night when Hurricane Alicia came, he uh, felt like that was a good opportunity to have a hurricane party. Uh, I think Bill and Dorothea must have been out of town. Uh, I that was, about that was a fun night uh, at the Fabian household. That was fun. When you first meet Bill, you see an individual with a positive personality, animated of a contagious passion for life, family, and community service. And it doesn't take you long to gain the admiration for him. As a compassionate doctor, a productive and innovative scientist, a committed teacher and mentor. Not only did he do well at Kincaid, he was very well liked. Um, he has always tackled every challenge that has been in front of him. There's, uh, he sees every mountain as just another great opportunity for a climb, and is. Uh, and just has tremendous perseverance.